Hello everyone and welcome into our first episode of this brand new farming sim game called Everdream Valley. Um, as you can see, this game has so many animals. I'm already addicted. Um, basically, we are a kid that gets dropped off at their grandparents' house and we must restore the farm. It is in shambles. It is in absolute shambles. Um, I've been playing this quite a bit so far. So I was like, hey, I have recordings of it. Let's break them up into videos. So um, let me know what you think of the videos. Let me know what you think of the game in the comments below, um, whether you like or dislike it. But otherwise, let's get right into it. I hope you enjoy. Hello, dears. Look at grandma. <laughs> Grandma's immediately like the happiest person in the entire world. Good morning, mother. Good morning, grandma. Hmm. What's got you looking so downtrodden, dearie? Aren't you excited for a vacation with your sweet old grandparents? Well, I am, but I was also hoping that mum and dad would stay too. We'd hope so too, but in the end, there was just too much for us to do at work. Oh, cheer up, dear. Why, with how many interesting things there are to do on this farm, I guarantee you'll forget your sorrows quicker than you can say molasses. What if we just steal the tomatoes? Oh, oh. Oh. So we gotta talk to grandfather. Talk to your grandfather. Hello. Why the gloomy face? That's that's not his voice. That's that's not his voice. Aren't you enjoying your vacation? I'm glad, but mum and dad were supposed to be here too. Well, unfortunately they could not leave their jobs. But I guarantee you that you will find enough company here. I have a suggestion for you. I heard that the traveling merchant also deals with stray animals. If you'd help me with some of these farm tasks, then I'll find him and see if he's taken any dogs recently. Apparently there's a lot of animals in this game and this is what kind of like separates the game a bit from other like farming sims is the fact that there's so many animals so that you can take care of those around you. And he may let you take care of one of them. Just one? What if we want more animals? First, trying to fix the old chicken coop. For this, you will need a hammer and an axe. You can use an axe to chop wood or destroy things. To destroy something such as a fence, use an axe on it. In the same way, prepare to harvest wood. If the wood did not fall out of the tree after you hit it, it means you will cut it down completely in a while. After three days, the tree will regenerate and you will harvest wood from it again. Okay. That seems pretty straightforward. Does anyone else hate chickens? I don't know. I think I had a bad experience with a chicken once where like it was it was quite a quite a hostile chicken. And then since that point, I was like, you know what? I'm not a fan of chickens. I am going to take every single crop here that... Oh my god, that's a big eggplant. That's a lot of eggplant. I just kicked that tree? <laughs> we can just give it a swift kick. Um, how, is that my entire inventory? Oh no, we got more. Okay. The, the tutorials are um, extremely in-depth, aren't they? How to hold down shift and run. By holding down the shift button, you can run faster. Sprint to consume stamina. Be careful that its level does not go down to zero. If you use up all the stamina, you won't run fast before many other actions until it turns from red to normal color. The, the tutorials are kind of explaining it as if you've never played a game before. So they really don't want you to... Oh my God, there's like a, a, a cat coming up. Oh my God, look at the chonka. Hold the pet. Hold the... Holds a pet. <laughs> All right, the game's made up for itself. As long as we can just go around petting animals, then we we essentially win, right? Yeah, is he a scholar or is this like a pet XP bar? Because it's going up in the middle. I can see it. It's like a relationship bar. Pet the chicken. No, see, chick chickens don't deserve pets. I don't know. I'm not. A, I'm not a chicken fan. I'm not a chicken fan. Oh my God, these chickens are hoarding. <laughs> these chickens are hoarding trash. How dare they? When you pet a chicken and it turns into a happy puddle of bird, that's just neat. Yeah, I don't think, I just never got to that point, I guess. Maybe I need to give chickens another chance. All right, let's fix this up. I need 15 wood first. Okay. Chop some trees down. All right, here we go. No, axe. Chop. Chop again. Oh, so that's our stamina. How does it regenerate? Over time or? 
Oh no, that's the health bar of a tree. Okay. That's the tree health bar. Interesting. Interesting. Repairing the chicken coop. Congratulations. Oh, did I just get stuck inside? Should I pick up this trash? Can I? <laughs> I hope we can um, recycle and get a bit of cash for it, you know? Grandpa? Yeah, look, I, we had a bit of a problem with the eggplants. Um, I may have taken every single one of them. Chicken coop fixed, Grandpa. Excellent work. I have one more task for you. Find the chickens that lived in the chicken coop. Last night, someone got into the farm, scared the chickens and destroyed their house. They probably hid in the bushes near the farm. A wooden sword would do best with bushes and grass. He's going to give a kid a sword? Also, take these dungarees. They belong to your dad. They are better suited for scrub running. When you find a hen, catch it and bring it back to the chicken coop. Or just chase it near the coop. Reminds me of um, if anyone's ever played the OG Pokemons when you had to chase the Farfetch back to its owner. Spoilers for the first ever Pokemon game, by the way. <laughs> Did you see that chicken? <laughs> wow. Oh, look at this thing. Do it again. Hey, come back here. Come back. Oh, wait. Come back. Yeah. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Oh, wow. Look at this. And this, and this um, everyone, is how you hold a, a chook. How you hold a chicken. That is a, that is a plump, chunky chicken. Also, no wonder they ran away. There's literally nothing holding them inside, right? Do they not have a lawnmower? I think it'd be a lot more efficient than a sword. I'm just going to put it out there. <laughs> Good work. More and more animals are appearing on the farm. However, you need to know that not all animals are the same. I'm not talking about subtle differences like the number of horns or limbs. What animals do you have at a farm that has horns? But about the serious issue of how often a particular breed of chicken lays eggs and a cow gives milk. All this knowledge can be found in the animal atlas. Guys, everyone get out of your animal atlas, please. Oh yeah, goats. Guys, you forget about the goats, all right? Sheep ram. Okay, look, look, I'll admit I was thinking about unicorns, all right? You can check with the seller to see if he has any in stock. Thank you, Grandpa. All right, everyone, get out your animal atlas and turn to page four. Oh, we are going to learn about chickens. Oh, we still need to go find more chickens. I think grandpa let them out. I think he said someone let them out, but really they just don't have a fence around the coop. And I think that's totally on grandpa. He won't admit it though. This is the, the chonkiest chicken. You know, if chickens were this cute and chonky, I don't think I'd mind them. I don't think I'd mind them. Look at all this grass. Wait, is it is this grass? And there's leaves. He's... Mm -hmm. na, 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 na. Wait. That chicken is going rogue. Chicken's going rogue. I had a, I had a theory this would happen, hey. I told you it would happen. Oh, wait, we can pet the chicken? Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I think we have to go around making sure that every, um, every animal gets adequate amount of pets. The cat's getting jealous. Oh, no. Never mind. It probably has food it's running towards. I think there's apple trees. You think? <laughs> oh my my. Okay. These tutorials are actually quite funny. Like, they're so over the top that they're kind of... Chicken! Hmm. What a strange stone. Okay. Is that, um... Is that all we're gonna say about that stone? Is that... Cool? Oh, it's got an X on it. 
Oh, uh, we got to dig here, probably. Once we are able to dig. Chicken collector, congratulations. You received a... Okay, I didn't get to see. Congratulations. From now on, you can sell chickens. <laughs> so we just sell them off. To sell an animal... Wait, but does... It gives us eggs, though. To sell an animal, chase it to bring it to the vendor's pen. You'll find information about which animals you can already sell in the merchant's cart. You can unlock the ability to sell in to selling other animals by completing more story quests. Hmm. If they're going to run away, we may as well sell them, right? But don't they give us eggs? If you guys leave your pen, I will sell you to the merchant. We got a deal? See what I did to that grass? Yeah, you better watch out. I'm lethal. I'm lethal. We got 10 grass. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, we have quests with both grandma and grandpa now. They're already leaving. Grandma, we haven't had a quest with you yet. I actually don't know if there's much in the way of a story to this game besides the fact that, like, you're a kid that's been brought to this farm that's, like, out of control and you need to fix the entire farm. <laughs> it's like, you know, the kid's old enough to work now. Go on. Out in the garden. Out in the garden. You need to earn some pocket money. Grandma, there are several fruit trees behind the house. Why don't we have more of them? It's an old orchid, dear. They used to be much bigger. There was so much fruit that we had to bring them into town to sell. Unfortunately, most of the trees have died from old age and lack of water. If you want, you can try to restore the orchid to its former glory. I would start by cutting down these old trees. Somewhere in the valley, you are sure to find wild, young fruit trees. Cryptic, think of the 20 heckin' roses. You can dig them up with a shovel and plant them in the orchid. Well, uh, we don't have a shovel. Grandma, we don't... Grandma. Oh, she just wants us to cut down the dead tree. What does Grandpa want us to do? Oh yeah, let's ask about the strange stone. Grandpa, there's a strange stone in the valley with an X painted on it. Another one? Once during one of my hikes in the valley, I came across such a boulder. There appears to be more of them. If you haven't already done so, try digging out with a spade. I, I don't have one, Grandpa. Undermine, someone buried some useful stuff. All the chickens have come home. Bravo. It looks like we are ready to take it. Taking a dog. Claps in the chat for dogs. I've already talked to the merchant. Run to him and choose your new friend. However, remember that a dog is also a responsibility and you must take care of it. As I just said, mine are like somewhere sleeping in, in my bed. So they take care of themselves sometimes. Of course, Grandpa. Um, question, question, question. Should I take one of these chickens to the merchant with me? And then we'll, we'll sell him a chicken. Because as you could see, this one was venturing away from its... Um, pen and I don't make shallow promises. I stick by what I say. So if the chicken leaves, it leaves for good. Has it produced any eggs yet? No. Did it have a chance? Maybe. Merchant? I have chicken. I have chicken. Good morning. Hello, sport. What brings you to my humble abode? Grandpa said you're involved in rescuing stray dogs. And then I can take one of them in. It's a stray dog. It's probably going to have some behavioral issues, potentially. Hmm. In fact, I spoke with your grandfather. He mentioned that he was a new helper on the farm. However, he did not mention that you were so young. Are you sure you can take care of a living creature? Psh, remember that a dog is a social animal. He needs a lot of exercise and companionship. I also need company. Poor kid. Poor kid's just straight up like, yeah, look, I'm kind of lonely. And I promise to take good care of the dog as it, des as it deserves. We have chickens on the farm and so far it's going quite well with them. Did we tell them we just literally sold off one of these chickens? <laughs> chickens, you say? Well, the dog is a little bigger, but maybe you can actually handle it. Chickens can be very stubborn. Yeah, we, we're, we're aware. 
Well, you can take care of one of my pupils. Stop by from one time to tell me how he's doing. Thank you. <gasps> we can choose. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So this one is cute. Looks a bit like a panda. Also cute. Okay, they're all kind of cute. That one looks like a teddy bear. <gasps> this one looks kind of like Marty if Marty was um, a mountain dog. Marty's my sausage dog. Is there a sausage dog? Mm, there's no sausage dog. There's a Shiba Inu. Newfoundland. A Saint I love St. Bernard's though. St. Bernard's are really cute. Oh, Bernizo. Oh. There was, um, I had a friend once that had a Bernese mount, a Bernese. And they brought the Bernese dog into work when it was a puppy. And this dog, it was like, already like way bigger than my dog as a puppy, but it's paws. It's paws are like the size of my hand. I got big hands. And I'm like, damn, this dog is going to be huge. Oh, chow chow though. I think we're going to go to the Benes. Yeah, the goal is to get all the dogs and then we have an army of dogs. Oh no, we have to name it. Do we have to name it? Oh, we have to name it. What should we name our dog? What should we name our dog? My dog is called Marty. Should I just call him? Oh, we have oh we have Cecil as well, but there was no Italian Greyhound. <sighs> Marty or Cecil? What if I start with Marty? I'm gonna name after my dog. Oh my god, it's off! Oh, come back! <laughs> come back! I just got you! Come back! <laughs> oh no, guys, they're losing our dog. We're losing our dog. Oh no. <laughs> oh well. No, come back. Come back. Stay with me. How do I... Oh! Oh! Cute. The level of the dog has risen. What if I pan it for like five hours straight? What if we just pan the dog and do nothing else? <gasps> it's great. I love it. All right, we need to chop down some trees. He, did, he didn't give me any money for my chicken. This man stole my chicken. What if I steal his large animal? All right, buddy. Keep following me around. So maybe if it runs, it starts to run off. Oh, we have to cut down old trees as well. God, there's so many. Wait, wait, come back. Marty. <laughs> come back. You know what? Maybe he just stays on the farm. Maybe he's trying to show me something. Buddy. Oh, don't hit him with a stick. we swim? In every game, you need to play the can we swim test where we find out very quickly. Oh my God, you can get ducks. Can we swim or will we drown? Can we swim or will we drown? This doesn't really seem like the type of game where we will die in water. <laughs> oh, we can't even enter. Okay. Well that, well, that lasted long. All right. So we need to chop down these old trees. Are these the trees we need to chop down? Ugh. These trees are dead. How are they still producing apples? You know? Someone has to ask all the hard questions. And these apples down below kind of look like oranges. You know? Kind of look a little bit like oranges. Hi, Grandpa. I got a dog. Grandpa, the dog keeps running away from me. That's because he doesn't know you well yet. And the farm is full of new sounds and smells. Take this stick and show it to your dog. Then try to throw it and wait for him to come back with it. Repeat this several times until two training indicators light up above the dog. The better trained the dog is, the more use will be on the farm. <gasps> we can teach the dog how to farm. That's pretty cool. Playing fetch increases your dog's training level. Take the stick in your hand and wait for the dog to come to you. Hold and release E to throw the stick and wait for the dog to fetch it. 
Above the dog's head, you will see an icon with a training level. At the second level, the dog will learn to track. On the third, it will help herd animals. Hey, not bad. Not bad at all. Um, where's our dog? Does our dog sleep? Here he is. Wait, where's my stick? Oh, we have a lot of sticks. Oh, we should probably put up the animal shelter somewhere so it doesn't get sick. Hey, buddy. No. I think we threw it too far. Wait, did we... Did we throw it around the corner? Did we bend the... <laughs> um, oh, wait, he's coming back. He's coming back. Thanks, buddy. Here. Yeah. Have a... Have a... Pat, good boy. Go get it. Oh yeah, if I just throw it right in front. Throw it right, like right here. Look at that. Oh, I, have to, I have to give him praise. Good job. Let's get him up to the next level so he follow, follows us around. How do I pick up the stick? You know what? We have more sticks. Ugh. Maybe the further I throw it, the more he levels up because he leveled up heaps before. Where should I put the animal shelter? Should I put it near the chickens? Do dogs eat chickens? Asking for a friend, asking. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Good boy. No, okay. We're apparently throwing again. I didn't actually mean to do that. Grandma, I did the thing. The chickens have a home again, Grandma. That's great, love. Now. You can put the up purchase by the cop and collect eggs every day. Every day. They don't. All you need is some hay, boards, and a visit to the workshop. You can prepare the boards from the wood on the saw house behind the barn. Okay. Prepare three perches using the workshop. I don't think we know where the workshop is yet, right? I'm going to see if we can sleep because I don't think a kid should be working hard <laughs> during the night time. Hi dear, I see that you're getting ready for bed. Please put these on before you go to bed. You'll definitely be more comfortable and you won't bring any unwanted company to your bed. They're hideous, aren't they? They're hideous pajamas. The last thing you need is bothersome. Oh, bed bugs. Yes, that's what I meant as well. I meant bed bugs as well. It's loading. What do grandparents do on the farm? Grandparents are no longer the youngest, but they still work on the farm. Every morning they will have you every morning they will have for you various things they have collected during the past day. Their quantity and time depends on what you yourself have collected over the past 24 hours. To collect the materials, talk to your grandfather. Oh, we don't actually get to see the bed. Hmm. Newspaper? We got can we read the newspaper? Oh, we just, I just realized we have a map. Hmm. It doesn't appear that we can. It doesn't appear that we can. Still more trash here. Right, where, where's Grandpa? Oh, he's over there. He's hanging out with my dog. Ugh. Grandpa, did you put all this trash here? Is that what you collected? Dog. You're right. The dog doesn't run from me anymore. Perfect. A dog that plays a lot is happy and an obedient dog. Sometimes. Dogs are known for an excellent sense of smell. I once had a dog that could smell apple pie from a neighboring county. On the farm, however, a dog's nose is useful for more than just locating treats. With its help, you can also find lost pets or objects. Some time ago, Grandma's beloved cow, Willow, went missing from the farm. This bell is the only thing of hers left on the farm. Take some special treats and give them to your dog to encourage him to track. Then show him the bell to catch the child to find poor Willow together. A trained dog level three can lead you to various objects. To get your dog interested in tracking, first feed him a dog treat. When a question mark appears above his head, take out the tracking object and press track. Then follow the dog to the location of the tra tracking target. If you remove the tracking object from your hand, the dog will lose interest in it. Okay. So we can track a cow now. Here, Grandma and I have collected some things that you can use. Yeah, he gave us a lot of things. Does he sleep? Do they sleep? 
I don't know if they sleep. Also, you... Do we have storage? Because, like... I guess he wants us to track... Hold on. Why do we have... Oh, I guess maybe a red quest is a quest we can't do yet. Red, green, yellow. So green's probably the first one we would do, I'd say. The chicken fill at home on the new farm. Now it's time to take care of its human inhabitants and get some eggs. Build purchase. Wait, when do we get a cow? Do we always have a cow? Look how chonky this cow is. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Hold on, hold on. No, don't run away from me. Oh my god. I should have fenced him in. Do I have to pick you up? Do I have to herd you back? Get back in there. Yeah, there you are. Guys, we have a cow. I don't mean to alarm anyone here. Don't you think about it. We've got to prepare this as much as we can. So the cow doesn't escape. Can the dog not get in now? Come in here, but wait, what if I if I don't want to pen you in as well? There we go. This is a chunky cow. Okay, here's the issue. I sold one of the chickens. <laughs> what if I go and steal it back? Do you reckon we can um, steal the chicken back? We may have to go and try and steal it back. A covert mission. The merchant will never know. I'm a sneaky child who didn't know any better. It's like, no, I didn't know I was selling the chicken. I just thought I was I was bringing him over for a play date. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We're just going to... Uh... Yeah. This is totally fine. Grandma, what's going on? Don't look at me. I'm, I'm definitely not performing Grand Theft Chicken. <sighs> go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, no. There's so many witnesses. To be fair, I don't think he ever gave me money for it in the first place. I don't think he gave me anything. Is this a water well? Oh yeah, we should probably repair that as well, hey. Alright, Mr. Chicken. I'm gonna dump you right on here. Wait, where's our where's our other chicken? Can you please Thank you? We appear to be missing a chicken. Is it behind the cat? Oh no. We've lost a chicken. We've lost a chicken. What a disaster. What's over here? Mm, okay, what other quest do we have? Find Willow. Place new fruit tree. I still don't understand how to do this. Like we don't have any... Do we just plant an apple? <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. That's a main. Oh, that's a main story quest. Let's go find this cow. Give me a treat first. Hey, buddy, you want a treat? Hunt. No. Treat. The dog is waiting for an object. Date. Oh, 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 oh. Ah. All right, let's go. He's on the hunt. He's on the hunt. We really don't know where he's taking us. This could be, um, could be reckless. Is the cow still in there? Yeah, cow's still in there. Hopefully it eats some of our grass because the grass is kind of, um, overgrowing a little bit. Hey. Oh. Okay. I don't, I don't know if he knows where he's going. <laughs> he is going in circles. I know you're looking for a scent, but... Bring Willow back to the farm. This is Willow. I... <laughs> Grandpa's like, you know what, son? We can't find this, uh, this cow anywhere. You're going to have to get your dog to help out. I don't know where it's gone. I don't know where it's gone. But it's somewhere. It's escaped the farm. It's gone far and wide and we just, we just can't find it anywhere. Can't find it anywhere. Please go out and look for my cow. How do we bring it back to the farm? Do I have to carry it? Or pet it. It's already at the farm. <laughs> what if we um open this door? Come on. Let's go. I'm bringing you back to the farm, Willow. 
I don't know. Do I have to bring you to the front door? Like... <laughs> yeah, maybe I gotta ring the bell. I had the bell equipped in my hand. Oh, no, I don't. I've given it to her already. Bring Willow back to the farm. I don't think Willow was supposed to be there initially. I think it was supposed to be over there. <laughs> unless, unless this is not the farm I'm supposed to be taking Willow to. What if I bring it back to grandpa? Yeah, come on, come to grandpa. Oh. Oh, these all need a lot of water. Okay, we should probably do that as well. Where's grandpa gone? He's over here. What's my favorite game? Mm, that's a tough one. What have I been really loving lately? Um, we I, I do like a lot of horror games as well, Marissa. Oh, we did it! <laughs> Just like that. Um, this is called Everdream Valley. So now we go back to Grandpa and be like, "Yeah, Grandpa, we found, we found the cow. It definitely. Oh God, it's gonna follow me around now. I'm giving it too many pets. Let's fix this up because we need to water these damn plants." Have the watering can. Does it just is it just automatically full? How does this work? Let's have a look. I love how he just swings whatever he's holding. Oh wait, can we walk? Oh we can! Yeah! <laughs> That's pretty fun. That's kind of satisfying actually. Good watering. Um hold on, Bernard, come here. Wait, Marty. Ugh. Keep him on his toes, you know. I wonder how our chickens are doing. We need to collect more eggs. If we can get um something we can ride, that'd be pretty damn heckin' cool. Um, hold the pet. Good chicken. Lay me my egg, please. Oh wait, no, get back on there. Oh no. Have we broken it? Have we Oh no. <laughs> Pick you up and then put you back. There you go. Um, please lay me many eggs. At least three. Hey, Grandpa. I found that um, it, it was a very long adventure and it was very tough, but I found the cow, you see. Well, I was already at the farm. Oh, it's supposed to happen. Here I was thinking I big brained it. Bravo. I expected nothing less from you. Now we need to fix her enclosure so she doesn't go on such a long walk again. I fixed it, but then I had to break it to get her out to bring her to the farm. Please take care. Please take these diagrams. You will build fences and gates using the workshop in the front of the barn. Oh. You know, there's already one built. Building an enclosed pen with fences and gates. The side enclosure place a plaque with the name of the animal. There can be different... Oh. That makes sense. Our chickens are running wild. So I think if we build a cow enclosure for Willow. What a strange bug. Uh, what? <laughs> can you guys, can anyone see the bug? Yeah, what a, what a strange bug. Oh, that's a strange bug. Hello. Can I? Uh, uh. We need like a net. We need a net. All right, so we craft and we craft a, how do we, so we can make, how do we make signs? So we have to make a new one. We can't use this one we have over here. Remember to put the cow sign inside. Like I was gonna put the cow sign in here, but is that cheating? Do we have a cow sign? Oh, we do. Oh, yes. Here we go. New item available to the merchant. Plaque with a cow. Oh, I wanted to... Hold on. Hold on. I want to face it like... No! <laughs> I'm so silly. Hold on. Let's do this. There we go. That's better. All right, now... We Open the gates and get the cow in here. Let's keep throwing sticks for a uh, friend. Where's the cow gone? I swear to God, if we've lost the cow. Over, over there. 
Willow. Oh, Willow. Chonky cow. No, 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 no. Come, come here. Come here. I'll give you pets. And you come follow me, all right? You come this way. I'll give you one more. Just because I like petting the chonky cow. <laughs> it's so satisfying. All right, let's go. Don't worry, Grandpa. It's happening. I'm on it. So we can have... Walk up to the animal and pet it. St the stroked animal will follow you for 20 seconds. Mm -hmm. The way you can guard the animal from enclosure to enclosure. Oh. So the idea is we want to have lots of each animal, I suppose. I won't cut the grub. No, stay. 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 Okay. Um, I'll leave the grass long because then the, the cow can eat the grass and we'll be laughing. Um, more animals. Where can I find more animals, Grandpa? Appetite grows as you eat, right, kid? There are several ways to bring animals to the farm. One of them is the preparation of homesteads and chasing or luring lost or wild animals into... Steal them. Steal the animals from whichever home they come from. I know that there are at least a few sheep wandering around the farm. The fastest way to chase them is by using the help of a dog. Train it to level three and build a sheep pen. Once you've done that, Come back to me and I'll teach you how to use your dog to herd sheep. Grandpa, there are beetles in the valley. Beetles, butterflies, dragonflies, and many other insects. You just have to look around and under your feet. You can also try and catch them in your hand or with a net. I'll tell you a secret from the beetles. You can make treats for animals. Hmm. Sheep, goats, chickens, and even horses will love it if you throw them some insect balls. Somewhere in the barn, there should be an old machine with the help of which you will prepare treats. Okay. Let's see if there's a way we can make more boards because we have a lot of wood. Wait, did it say we can craft more boards from the wood? Oh, we can make an insect net. That's pretty cool. We need like a, um, like a mill, like a lumber mill. Oh, we do have storage. The chest has a hundred spots. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. We might need the milk jug eventually. We should probably get an animal shelter for like the dogs and stuff. I'm gonna put the animal shelter near the um near the house. Just so he has um somewhere to lay, you know. Buddy, do you want the shelter? I'm gonna just put it here. <laughs> there you go. Look at that. Now if it rains, yeah, you can go under there if it rains, alright? Gotta make sure that your um, doggies are happy. Speaking of which, I need to go check on mine. They they literally just woke up and they're running a, running amok. Saw. Oh, oh, hold on. Oh my God, it's like Stardew fishing. <laughs> Bella, thank you for the likes. Oh. Kind of makes me dizzy. <laughs> oh. 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 Yeah. I guess you would get better at it eventually. For those who don't know, I absolutely hate Stardew fishing. I complain about it all the time. I complain about fishing games. And then to have a, a saw mechanic, which reminds me of it, is triggering. It's slightly triggering. Fence. I think we just make all the fence we can. It just told us how to make planks. We already know. We already, we already heckin' found it out, alright? We already found it out. Oh, we don't want that. Build a fence. Build a fence. Nice. Well, that's a good little first glance at the game. Um, we may be on uh, randomly at night night times so um guys if you do want to um hang around for more lives make sure you do um make sure you follow so you do get notified that'd be awesome uh, we're playing lots of different indie games on this account going forward so if you like your indie games like some wholesome indie games to check out um yeah make sure you stick around otherwise i'll see you next time thanks for hanging out thanks for checking out everdream valley i appreciate you all goodbye thanks for watching